Recently, uh, something happened in TikTok uh, whereby a cow uh, reverse image several local brands' products in Singapore and found unbranded versions uh, of the product sell at a much lower price in Taobao. Uh. Now, if you are very angry, uh, what's wrong? Uh? So, so, uh, so, when these videos, uh, which we will not be showing here, uh, surface, uh, people were telling the account to call out more local brands. Uh. Brands that appear uh, you know, to buy products from China, set their brand names there, and then sell them uh, in Singapore. Now, if you somehow felt shocked, uh, I don't know what word you are living in. Uh. You see, uh, this is a very common business thing. Eh? Getting shocked and angry over this uh, is like getting angry uh, over the fact that the cake you just makang uh, has many carries. Eh? Yeah, la, you angry for what? Yeah? With my wife, man? Eh? But you get the idea lah, cause uh, this is actually something known as white label. Now, some of you uh, think that it's called OEM, but no way. For OEM, uh, it's an uh, Apple uh, telling company ads uh, to manufacture iPhone 21, giving company ads uh, all the specs and whatnot lah. So, Apple has to come up with the specs and whatnot lah, and company ads uh, is the OEM, which is just a manufacturer, known as the original equipment manufacturer lah. For white label, uh, the so-called local brand uh, doesn't do that. Instead, you just look at the products that company ads manufacture, buy them, and then insert its logo, and package them lah. They can then be sold uh, under a different Brand, uh. That sounds bad, uh. since what they do uh, is to step their logos uh, onto products they are already manufactured, right? But right. many things in the world uh, is like that one. Eh. What if I tell you uh, that established F&B outlets uh, also buy fruits from food factories and then uh, mark up the price uh, and then sell them in their outlets? What if I tell you uh, the so-called house brands that we see in supermarkets uh, are merely just white label products, although uh, right. they call it private labels. Uh. By the way, for supermarket ones, uh, they usually customize the product more, uh, that's why they are called private labels. Uh, oh. And of course, some of the things uh, you buy from Shopee uh, are white label products. That's why I'm uh, back in the past, uh, you see people sell you courses on how to be a millionaire uh, through Amazon. They are actually teaching you uh, how to do white label. Uh. You see, the whole idea of white label uh, looks easy, but it's not. Eh. Because when we buy something, uh, we only look at two things, price and quality. There's a third intangible thing uh, that you probably didn't think of, and it's lingering uh, in your mind subconsciously. Marketing. That is the difference between normal products and white label products. You see, marketing uh, is actually the process of getting an item from the manufacturer to the end consumer. And other than the tangible aspects, uh, that's the intangible one, the value. Most of the times, uh, we buy things not based solely on the price and quality, uh, but on the value. And value uh, is very, very subjective, uh, you know, can go up and down. I mean, just think of your type, uh, Uncle and uh, Abe, uh, when I buy, uh, it's $3.30. When Sobilan buy, uh, it's $2.30. Same dish, same number of rice, somewhere, and worst of all, uh, Sobilan uh, didn't even finish. The rice in Nabe. With the correct marketing, you can sell a 40 cent pen uh, for $400. And people will still think it's cheap. Therefore, uh, what you should be angry uh, isn't why an item is a white label product. Instead, you should be angry at its marketing instead. Because price uh, isn't just determined by the products, but by its marketing. Because let's face it, uh, let's face it. Uh, AC logo uh, is so powerful and common. Uh, many of us uh, buy cars uh, not for the quality, but for the logo. And woman, uh, you think they buy the bag for its quality? <laughs> Sorry, uh, we love money, so I need to insert an ad here. Uh. If not, uh, I know food, uh, and then we'll lose my battery. For this video, we don't have a sponsor, uh, so if anyone wants to buy an app sort like this, uh, email us, uh, link in profile, or guarantee views one way. Eh. Also, uh, download our app, because uh, we know sponsor for this video, uh, so we sponsor ourselves. Uh. <laughs> but this month, no pay. Uh. Now, what can we learn from this? Eh? We are all stupid idiots. Uh. Get angry, because uh, we think we pay for quality and price. But it's all about marketing. So in other words, uh, we are all idiots. Uh. <laughs> The good thing is that once you know this, uh, you won't be so idiot. Uh. Now, if you think I learned something, uh, consider subscribing. Uh, and also watch this video uh, to be slightly smarter.